when I first got locked up in the jail, they took my boxers and my socks because we weren't allowed to have any underclothes that weren't white. And it took about a month to finally get to commissary and have some money and be able to buy some underwear. So during that time, I had no socks or boxers. Once I got to DOC or to a real prison, they gave us three of everything. Three socks, three boxers, and three t-shirts. But there's seven days in the week, and two of those days your stuff is in the wash, so we ended up having to wash it in the shower and the sink pretty regularly. Once I got comfortable, I went to the laundry workers and just paid them to give me all the state clothes that I needed. But some places were really tight on that, and they made you actually go to commissary and order it. But when socks are $2 a piece, and boxers are $3 a piece, and shirts are $8 a piece, well, that's kind of hard when you're making 27 cents an hour, if you can get a job. To be fair, most of the officers where I was didn't trip about this because they wanted people to have clean clothes and not walk around dirty and smelly. But some places just have a totally different mentality. 